This is the Bay Area's news station. Cron 4 News at 8 News at 8, now. the first video of the two sisters charged with abusing and neglecting infants at their daycare center in Livermore. Prosecutors say they bound the baby so tightly the children could barely breathe. Parents are outraged as the women are formally charged today. They hit it very well. They're very good liars and con artists. In the midst of all of this, the family of the daycare owners tells Crown 4 that the sisters have done nothing wrong. Crown 4's Teresa Astacio reports. With their hair pulled over their faces to block the camera's view, the two daycare workers who are sisters huddled together, speaking briefly to their attorney through a glass partition during their first court appearance since their arrest. Both are facing seven counts of child neglect, stemming from what police say was a disturbing crime going on here at this Livermore infant and preschool. Investigators say that the two women were swaddling babies by tying up their legs and arms so they couldn't move. Plus putting blankets over their faces, blocking their ability to breathe. Their contention is that it's not abuse. There's um, a fight ahead in this case, as you can probably imagine. This is not the first time one of the sisters, Lita Sharif, has been in trouble for her swaddling methods and other daycare practices. In 2010, here at the same facility, Cron 4 News has learned that the state revoked Lita's license. In documents obtained by Cron 4 News, the state banned her from operating a facility due to problems discovered involving swaddling as well as having too many children plus one instance of inappropriate care of a child by hosing him down after he soiled himself. The state allowed Lita to sell the place and she did to her sister who changed the name and hired Lita as an employee. That is until last month when the state launched another investigation, this time following a tip from a former employee about alleged swaddling problems. Outside the courtroom, outraged parents lashed out at the sisters. Did you, have safe, any, did you have any idea what was going on there? No, no idea. We have two kids there. The sisters remain in custody. They are back in court next week. A family member tells Cron 4 News that this is a big misunderstanding and that they have done nothing wrong. In Livermore, Teresa Stasio, Cron 4 News.